Good morning. Who are you? Uh, Peter Hammer, ma'am. You're 37 minutes late. Oh, yes. The mid-semester transfer from Alhambra High. I was told by our principal that you were going to USC on a scholarship. Uh, yes, ma'am. Biology grant. Nice of you to pay us a visit on your way to fancy academia land. This is the communications elective. More like the all their sections were filled leftover elective. <laughs> Be quiet, Natalia. Am I in the wrong class? You're in the right class. Take a seat and come see me after class. The rest of you, I want 10 examples of advertising gimmicks from the 1950s, and I'm going to collect these first thing tomorrow morning. I'm going to check out the handouts. No funny business while I'm gone. What? What? Uh, 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 thanks for the sweet table. Nice table. That was sweet of you. Sweet. Last time someone called me sweet was probably never. Sweet, nice, it's the same thing, yeah. Hey, it takes guts transferring mid-semester senior year. I respect that. It's not like I had a choice. Oh, parents. Forgive them, for they know not what they do. I'm trying to focus here. She's the parasite queen. A perfect plastic Barbie who wears her dad's credit cards as earrings and has pretty designer clothing on all the time. Like a Paris Hilton? Mm, I'm gonna say it, I actually like Paris Hilton. What? Yeah, I mean she sued the guy for making the sex tape and then donated all the money to environmental causes. Saving the world one sex tape at a time? <laughs> I think he's hot. I said I think he's hot. In like an I don't know what's going on kind of way. He's gonna be a USC nerd for crying out loud. A hot USC nerd. Get into it, Jill. Totally a hot nerd. Nerds are in, Jill. Get into it. You're literally just repeating what she said. Ew. Desperate. He obviously wants you back. So sad. Some people are just stuck in last season. I, however, am all about the future. Hello? Why are looking for my things? Um, uh, so, sorry, it was, it was an accident. You were an accident. I don't know what kind of glorified daycare you came from, but here at Kennedy, we come to class on time, understood? Uh, yes ma'am, my apologies. Don't yes ma'am me. I disdain brown nosers. I own you for the rest of the year. And just like the rest of the class, you owe me a senior project. Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, Miss Getty. So, think of a topic, something spectacular, and a title. Topics are due Friday. Get out. Andy! Get in here! Hi. 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 I'm Andy. I'm Peter Hammer. Yeah, the transfer from Alhambra High. Yo, we're in the same comp class. Uh, oh, are, are you here working on your senior project? Yeah. Oh, senior project blues, huh? Yeah, I'm completely screwed. Oh, no. So, what did you do to get Miss Getty? I didn't do anything. She was assigned to me. If you don't want me to say anything, I won't, all right? But, but like, listen, man, you're going to USC. You're on. Academic suspension or something? Drugs? Meth. Meth. You. Do you chase the white tiger? Do I look like I do meth to you? Actually, wait, don't answer that. Just, 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 
get here is weird. No, it's, it's not. It's not. You see it? Uh. Hey, Natalia. <laughs> what do you want, Andy? Oh, hey, new guy. Oh. Hello, I'm Peter. Peter. What do you think I should get my dad? Prada or LV? Nah, see me, I would. No, <laughs> not you, Andy. Oh, um. Yeah, you should. I don't really know. I don't shop much. You don't? <laughs> I, I don't buy stuff. I, people buy stuff for me. Um, but good luck shopping for your dad. Thanks. That was hot. <laughs> He's a badass. Um, seriously. You like Andy. Jill, just do your copies. Point of homework. It's like I'm home. Why am I working? Yeah. It's so strange. It's really strange. Julie Bear. I need you to do me a favor. Of course, anything. I need you to get intel on the hot new guy. I want to know what he likes, what he doesn't like, where he lives, anything else you can find out. So you want me to go undercover? Yes, like 21 Jump Street. Cool. Okay. Bye. Bye. Oh, okay. Bye, Natalia. Hey, Natalia. Isn't espionage a little tacky for you? No pretending to have new friends at all? <laughs> okay, you're one to talk about pretending, Spencer. <laughs> you're the one who pretended to be my boyfriend before coming out as gay. Do you know how embarrassing that is for me? How is that embarrassing for you? So, uh, you live around here? Yeah, nearby. Nah, like most of us. That's cool. Hey, by any chance, like, you want cookies? Cause... So, uh, how far do you walk every day? Uh, Sam! Whoa! What the hell? Please. <laughs> you okay? Uh, yeah. It looks like everyone's a klutz today. <laughs> yeah, thank you. It's very sweet of you. Wow, these are some amazing doodles. Oh, well, they're sketches, but thanks. I want to be a fashion designer, so these are for the senior project. Oh, uh, fashion's your topic? It is. How we communicate in an eco-friendly manner through what we wear. I wrote my design school essay on that topic as well. So, uh, Miss Gay's a fan of that uh, senior project, huh? <laughs> yeah, she makes it seem like the be-all, end-all, but it really doesn't matter that much. It's just I'm really looking forward to USC. May mean staying in one place more than six months. Moving sucks. Yeah, it does. Hey, do you want me to walk you home? Uh, thanks, but I, I need to stop at the store. Uh-huh. You sure about that? Because, you know, I could protect you. From what? Kennedy High's resident stalker. Yo, listen, man, I am like the authority of everyone and everything at Kennedy. That's because you stalk people. Man, all right, I'm serious, all right? Listen, listen, okay, check this out. You know Sylvester Stallone's ex-wife lives here? Alone. Did you know that? Oh, okay, stop. This house right here? Man, when you're walking home, make sure you be careful, man. I'm telling you, it's some people that moved into that house. Woo! These people are Russian mobsters. They're just slinging guns and drugs. You... That's where I live. This is just the video game chamber. Just for video games? Bro, so that means your room is what? What, twice as big? Oh, you gotta let me see it. Uh, what's your favorite video game? Oh man, I don't really, I don't really have a favorite video game. I'm not really much of a gamer, you know? But you gotta let me tour that room. 
Oh, oh no. Is this a Super Nintendo? Yeah. Oh my God. I swear, I, I love Nintendo. Like, that's my favorite games. I was gonna get Nintendo <laughs> tattooed on me. Oh my goodness. All you're doing is blocking and jumping. No. What is that? Listen, all right? I wish there was like a barrier right here. Like a little glass wall or something. Ah! Ah! Oh my goodness! Bro, I cannot believe I'm winning this game. I've never even played this before. Me neither. What? It's your game. I, I just haven't played it in a while. Yeah, right? Ah! Oh my gosh! Oh! What? Woo! All right. Tour time. Let's go to the kitchen. Come to me. Please put those back. Bro, oh my goodness. This ice cream is on a whole other level, man. I swear, I've, just, I've never had potato ice cream before, ever. Who knew they had leeches, lobster? Ice cream? Oh, no, 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 no. Hey, that, that is not a way to treat a guest. Hey, look, if you want ice cream, let's go to the market and I'll get you a cart full. Man, I don't understand. I don't understand, all right? Checks for the house. Hold on, I'll have to call you back. Okay, sounds good. Uh, hello, Mrs. Hammer. I'm Andy. Nice to meet you. Um, I thought we had an agreement, no friends over. It's fine today, but he's coming back next week, so don't make it a habit. And guys, let's clean up whatever's going on here. Yo, uh, you wanna tell me what just happened? All right, look, here's the deal. Please don't tell anybody, but this isn't my house. My mom is the new live-in maid and she works for this billionaire. So we get to stay here for free. So like, where's this billionaire at now? He's probably somewhere in the south of France on a super yacht. Look, man, your secret is safe with me, all right? But by my calculations, that gives us more than enough time to eat this ice cream and replace it before he gets back. <laughs> Let's go, <get our> man. <laughs> but hey, you know this like makes us best friends now, right? All right? So I'm gonna need you to put it there. Right there. Come on, don't leave me hanging. It turned into a punch after a long time. Come on, don't leave me hanging. There it is. All right, man, grab a spoon, bro. And I'll share this billion dollar ice cream with you. <laughs> Andy. <laughs> yeah? I heard his dad is a gangster. A gangster? Like Tony Montana. <laughs> <laughs> so what's he like? Is he like an average dad or is he a hot gangster nerd dad? Who's a hot gangster nerd dad? <laughs> there you are. Yeah, she was asking me if your dad would. Oh my God. I know you've been having a hard time adjusting, so I got you something. My dad wanted the one with the stripes, so this one was left over. Wow, snakeskin. How did you know that? Uh, I guess it's just a hobby of mine. Oh, Andy, be a doll and give oh. us a little bit of privacy. Privacy? Oh, no, I'm sorry, I do apologize. I can't do that, you know, privacy. This is my bro right here. It's no privacy okay, between. Okay, the vending machine is spitting out free snacks. I'll be, be back. All right, all right. A little stronger than you look. Thanks. Did you just get voted off the island? Are you jealous? Uh, please. I thought the ice queen was saving herself for an imaginary reunion with Spencer. Spencer? Yo, this dude has got balls. Like, I mean, his dad is running for public office and he decides to come out now? <laughs> no, that couldn't be me. And then this guy over here, man, you know he has a home theater with video games, like every single video game that you could even imagine. And then he took me to the kitchen? Girl, the kitchen got so you much- You ramble I... a lot. It's like, I can't believe your dog is named Alexander Wang. That's effing Brills. Do you think it's Brills, Peter? Hello, Earth to Peter. Yes, uh, very effing Brill. 
Sorry, I'm probably boring you with all my fashion talk. Um, why did you send Andy away? It's like in science, okay? Hot, cool animals hang out with other hot, cool animals. Swans don't hang out with bears because bears are annoying and ugly. That's probably because they'd be eaten almost immediately. Exactly. Do you want Andy to eat you? The point is that you are a hot nerd and I want you to hang out with us because you're hot. Um, I'll, I'll think about it. You're always thinking. Hey, are you in the spirit realm? Or are you in the earthy realm? Oh, my bad. Spirit. Spirit. I'm lying in Shavasana. The most important pose in yoga, so quiet. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Shavasana. Of course, Shavasana. <laughs> all right, I'll tell you what. Let me know when you get back, all right? I'm so sorry. I didn't got a little chip on your head. Please, was, man. I'm, you know, I'm just, please, I'm just trying please. to help. I'm just Come trying on. to help. I, I'm, I got you. What's your topic for senior project, huh? I still haven't decided. Stop. Sorry. Still haven't decided. So, like, are you jealous of Natalia and Peter? Whoa, Seriously? What, you sitting up? <laughs> what do I have those questions even have to do with you, man? Yo, man, listen. Everyone's been acting so weird since he got here. Listen, dude. The girls are just bored. That's it. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess you're right. <laughs> okay, now, when you ready? Uh-huh. Take a deep breath in, let it out, and slowly lie back with your palms facing up, okay? Palms. All right, let's all break up into small groups and start declaring topics. Peter, can I join your group? Um, actually, we work better if we're just keeping the group small. One more person doesn't make it that much bigger. It really does, actually. <laughs> yes, Natalia? I don't have a group. Uh, why don't you join Mr. Hammerstein's group then? <laughs> oh, Spencer. Perfect. Take a seat. If the universe wills it. Who's first? Um, well, I will be doing a fashion show that features eco-friendly, affordable clothing for the high school students. <clears throat> Natalia, you forgot to include me in your group like we discussed. Yeah, Jill, about that. Peter here is my new fashion assistant, so you're no longer necessary. Thank you. <laughs> Damn, another one bites the dust. Okay, who's next? I'll go. I'll be doing a fashion show as well, but I'm going to be doing real fashion. High fashion, not weirdo fashion. Wow, you really are a demon from hell. You just flat out stole my idea. Um, excuse you? You didn't invent fashion shows. You're just afraid of my impeccable taste. Are they going to fight? Yeah. yeah I'm fashion brings out the worst in them. Afraid of the holes that you're gonna have to cut in the back of the clothing to make room for all your demon bitch wigs to just pop out. Um, Samantha, you can watch your language. And you can both do fashion shows. You just have to communicate your ideas clearly. Who's next, Spencer? Well, uh, I am gonna make a cookbook for my Elva Lacto vegetarian recipes. Is that a Star Trek thing? No, man. It means he doesn't eat meat, but he still eats animal products like, you know, uh, honey, eggs, milk. It's simple, Peter. Nothing with a face. That sounds delightful. <laughs> All right, Andy, what's yours? Uh, oh, I am doing a documentary about my friends. Who are your friends? Who are his friends? Yeah, they were friends. <laughs> um, it's, it's, it's gonna be a reflection of high school before, you know, reality hits. Good luck with that. And Mr. Hammerstein. Hammer. Well, what is your topic? I didn't uh, think of anything. You mean you don't have one after I specifically told you you needed one by today? Um, yeah, I, I have one here somewhere. Oh, did you take these? Yes. 
They're really, really good. You know, I dabbled in photography myself. <laughs> you better do an incredible job. Don't disappoint me. All right, everybody. No, you cannot. I don't know anything about the topic. Don't worry, marijuana. there's great I've iPhone apps for that. Twice already. I don't have an iPhone. You still got apps. Remember, the senior project is worth two thirds of your grade. So if you don't pass, you don't graduate. Have a nice day. Uh, Sam. Look, uh, I may need you to write me a poem that you can actually read at my funeral. What, do you have like a fatal illness, like one of those Lifetime movies? Uh, yes, I do. The uh, pressure of the senior project has caused a fatal ulcer. I may not make it to graduation. Hmm, lucky you. <laughs> oh, come on, I was kidding. Look, I'm sorry I hung out with her, okay? She did something nice, and I felt like I had to be nice back to her. Yeah, I guess you're right. I'd much rather you not cross over into bitch mode. Okay. Look, since we're already walking, do you wanna come over? Somebody followed me home the other day, it was kinda scary. Wait, someone followed you in this neighborhood? Yeah. He's probably at my fridge right now. Breaking and entering for Hagen dazs That's just sad, Andy. Yeah, but you haven't tried this new flavor of Lynch's lobster. You know what, though? I can't really blame him. This place is kind of incredible. You know, Peter doesn't really live. That, um, Peter doesn't really live that extravagantly. It's, uh, it's, it's normally his father. <laughs> yeah, so, um, hey, you guys wanna go do some work or something like that? Do you think Miss Getty really wants us all to fail? Of course she does. She's a pathetic troll who hates everybody. This one time I saw her spill her frappuccino all over my college portfolio sketches. She didn't even say sorry. She'll do anything to be sure that I don't go to fashion school. You're gonna strike that from the record, right, Andy? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Strike, strike that. I have to graduate. I don't know anything about photography. Okay, well, let's figure this out. There has to be something interesting that you can photograph. Buildings? Oceans? How about you photograph your bugs? <sighs> See, I, it's weird. You guys saw them, let's go back downstairs. Oh, really? Tell me, why do you collect bugs? Okay, well, um, these aren't just any bugs. They're masters of camouflage. They can fit in anywhere and disappear when they want to. <laughs> well, I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of gross, but uh, I don't know, it's actually kind of cool. <laughs> um, I think you just found your senior project. <laughs> Yo, this documentary's for a senior project, right? Uh, <laughs> Yeah, Miss Getty said it was cool. Miss Getty, I swear to God, she'll do anything to get in my pants. <laughs> Shut up, man. <laughs> Dude, you don't even realize, bro. Like, I swear to God, she hasn't been late since at least the 94 Guns N' Roses tour. <laughs> I'm not joking. <laughs> Yo, you're gonna edit that out, right? Uh, yeah. Better. So, uh, what is this concoction? That is vegetarian meatloaf. Oh, interesting. Mm. Why have you chosen this dish? Well, my dad, for some reason, likes meatloaf and hates the fact that I'm a vegetarian, so vegetarian meatloaf. So, uh, what, do you just do everything to spite your dad? <laughs> <laughs> no, actually. But that asshole wants me to go to Georgetown and become some politician or something, and all I really want to do is go to Nepal and find my spiritual awakening. So, uh, 
What's stopping you? Well, <laughs> in order to go on a spiritual awakening, you need cash flow. Mm -hmm. And I won't have cash unless I get my trust fund, and he won't give me my trust fund unless... I got you. Good. Now, you need to be sage because you're... No. Experiencing no some negative energy. Um, um, you, you're messing up. This is my school shirt, bro. What the fuck? So, the name of my new fashion show is... Drum roll, please. Oh my god. Genius. I love it. No, I meant like actually do a drum roll for the announcement. Oh, I can't. I just got my nails done. It's called Hot Nerd. I named it after my new assistant, Peter Hammer, and his dad, who are both hot nerds. I'm having trouble picturing this. Yeah. Okay. Well, for inspiration, I've compiled photos of some of the hottest nerds of all time. <laughs> Isaac Newton, Albert Einstein, and yum. <laughs> Christopher Lloyd. Okay, but no. Christopher Lloyd is not a nerd. He is an actor from the 80s. God, I hate this school. <laughs> Total psychopath. She's a little odd. <laughs> Chill? <laughs> Is it that awful Natalia girl? I've seen the way that she treats you. You know, they used to bully me in high school. Boy, did they regret it. You can outsmart them. I can show you how. Hello? Hello? Mr. Butterfly? Okay! Okay! <laughs> ah! What? <laughs> ah, relax! Relax, it's just me! Man, I just wanted to catch you in your natural habitat. What? My bad, man, I didn't mean to spook you. <laughs> really? because you're running around in the middle of a jungle, wearing a Wookiee suit, making growling noises. You are bound to spook somebody! First off, I wasn't gurgling, all right? My stomach was growling because I ain't eat my burrito like I always do this morning. Anyways, what do you think of the suit, huh? Huh? You know, my, my brother used to use this for paintball. <laughs> Quick lesson in boundaries. Using a military suit, using tactical strategies, running around the forest, looking like a whatever that is, look, I'm calling the police next time. Man, if you call the cops on me, they'll never find me. I masked this whole thing in dark shit so that even if the police were to come here, they, ain't, they gonna think they following the person, they gonna end up following some dog that just took a shit. They'll never find me. Invisible, bro. What is wrong with you? I got some great footage of you, bro. Thought you was about to cry. Dude, I shit my pants. You look so adorable. <laughs> They have macro lenses and, and, and apps that are literally for close photography, man. I'm telling you, she won't know the difference. Shut up, wood monster. Whoa, man. Sensing some serious negative energy going on over there. Let's cut it out, yeah? It's not coming from me. My energy is always not negative. Plus, I'm so excited about my fashion show. You guys will never guess what my new title is. Hmm, is it hot nerd? Spencer, it is really creepy when you do that weird reading people's minds thing. Natalia, we dated for almost a year. Yeah, but it doesn't count because now you're gay. Oh. Okay, can we just get this over with, please? Yes, great idea, Sam. Um, everyone, we're going to give a one-minute summary of our research. Go. Okay, does anyone have a timer? Oh, oh my goodness, I just remembered I have something way better than that. That's right. Dude, what the hell are you doing with that? It's an alarm cock. Found it next to your grandma's TVs. <laughs> Bro, you obviously have an issue with invading people's privacy. I'm sorry, what is that? 
an alarm cock. Okay, so it's like to simulate like a rooster like crowing to wake you up, but for like the heavy sleepers, it has this vibrating mode. <laughs> Okay, that's disgusting. Maybe it belongs to Spencer. Uh oh, uh -oh hey, Seriously, watch Natalia? out! Watch out! Ah. Put that get thing away. Get away! Okay, you know what? I think I've gotten everything that I need from this meeting. So, uh, bye, guys. Got some on your shoulder. Uh, got... Where is she going? What? Uh, I think she wants his rooster. <laughs> Not on my watch. I'm getting my man. All right. Oh, oh my god! It, I don't know. It's like this thing has a mind of its own. So, uh, how's your senior project coming along? So great, in fact, that uh, staying here with a uh, bitch and doofus is actually a total waste of time. <sighs> hey, um, do you want to go to the zoo? It, it could be really good for your senior project. Yeah, sure. Peter, are you ready for a shopping trip? Remember, you promised me. That's right, yeah. Fashion assistant. I forgot. I booked the whole store and I don't want to keep anyone waiting. Of course you don't. Have fun. So they shut down the whole store for you? Of course. I can't shop with other people around. It's distracting. Let me know if you need anything, okay? Um, this isn't Perignon. <clears throat> what are you trying to feed me? Yeah, actually, my manager says I can't serve to underage customers anymore. I'm so sorry about that. Okay, well, you don't tell your manager, and I won't tell everyone that your mom got alopecia when the housing market crashed, and then she filed for bankruptcy, leaving you guys uh, broke, so you had to get a job as a sales girl here. <laughs> now go get me the real stuff. Thanks. Um, that was a bit harsh. She needs a reminder of where she stands on the food chain. Okay, ready? No, no, no. You know what would make this picture better? <laughs> Me. One, two, three. Don't you think this is all a bit much? Renting out a whole store and Spending all this money? What's the problem? Do you hate the clothes? No, I think it's wasteful. Oh, today is a special day. Is it spoiled rich girl day? Look, I, I'm sorry. No, no, no. No, it's fine. It is a spoiled rich girl day. And it just happens to be this spoiled rich girl's 18th birthday. Nobody remembered? None of my friends from school. Not psychotic Jill, not even my father, who is on a business trip in Reno, which is just code for with his skanky casino mistress. So, jackpot, I'm here spending his money. Hey, don't cry. My therapist says that I have OCD or something, or like a, an addiction problem or a compulsion problem or whatever. But really, it's just daddy issues. Uh, can we just finish out the year? See, that's the thing. Everybody thinks I'm stupid. I'm not stupid. So Sam thinks I'm stupid. I'm sorry I'm not as talented as her, okay? Not everybody can be talented all the time. <laughs> I snorted all the cash in here. looking for. Just this once you can come over next to me. Come on. Really? Yeah. And look at them. Really? Yeah. All right, not, not too close, all right. Oh, that's perfect. Great. <laughs>
That's great. Okay, so this picture, this is Natalia with Peter and they were at the Sen Boutique and they were trying on clothes. Oh, it seems that they're plagiarizing. Yes. They can't do that. They can't. No. I mean, am I, am I wrong? Am I oh, right? Yeah. Am I, I mean, no, you're not. I, I, I know you're not wrong. I, yeah. No, I'm right. Oh, okay, so she's trying on clothes. <gasps> oh, this is amazing. <laughs> well, excellent. Would you like to uh, stamp my pad? Go ahead. Oh, it's good. It feels good. Do it really hard. You know, just yeah, yeah. That's this it. This is like yeah. what I imagine drugs to be like. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I know. What's up, Sam? What the hell are you both doing here? Well, we're here to do the senior project, considering we didn't do it at all earlier. Yo, are you guys really sure you want to do this? Natalia said that eco-friendly. Can you like... stop talking about Peter for like thirty seconds, please? You can be such a royal hemorrhoid sometimes. Dude, what is up your ass today? Okay, I just thought maybe he would be over the whole bitches with money thing, but no, he fell into Natalia's trap just like everybody else. Natalia is a master seducer and she did the exact same thing to me. Hey, if it means anything, I think Peter digs you way more than Natalia. Yeah, and you know that because you're his, what, supposed best friend? Uh, duh. <laughs> oh guys, I think it's me. Who's hitting you, bro? Who's that? It says unknown. What is it? What? I am in a babbling brook. I am in a babbling brook. Why are you in a babbling brook? I'm a babbling brook. Yo, what happened? I am a babbling brook. Yo, y'all are acting like y'all just seen I'm Voldemort. A brook. You know her goal in life is to make me miserable. And get in the way of my happiness. Yeah, but Spencer downstairs will tell you that happiness comes from the inside. <laughs> oh, he's read too many self It's not on a shower curtain. Thank you. <laughs> Listen, look, Natalia is not that out to get you. Like, you gotta understand, she's all about image. And right now, she's just going insane because of that crazy debacle that happened with Spencer last month. I mean, he just broke up with her for no reason in front of everyone. Like, she's not over that. And now she's stuck in the friend zone. Well, welcome to my world. <laughs> Damn, friend zone. Hey, uh, you know, um, this whole thing kinda makes us best friends, too. <laughs> I'm going back to work. You know, I will never understand how a guy like you was ever the apple in Natalia's eye. So, have you been doing yoga since you broke up with Natalia? Yep, to the day, actually. Really? Yes, Andy. Ah, down my dog. <sighs> Oh man, that hurt. Yo, dog, that's not right. This is right, bro. This is exactly what you're doing. A little Straighten sexy. Straighten out your knees. Ah, you're gonna break my knee. Straighten out your knees. Stop it. Just right here with me, breathe hey. in. Hey, what is this? And come up. Oh, for Christ's sake. This is, I don't know if I, I'm not sucking it. All right, I'm done with this yoga. Dude, it's come to my up. attention that certain students are utilizing professional help in their projects. And it states in the senior project handbook, you can't do that. Hit it, chill. Oh, 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 oh. All right, the two students are obviously complicit in their utilization of professional help, namely the designers at the Sen Boutique and planning to plagiarize their designs. 
where did you get this picture? Who the hell took this? You've been spying on me. You psychopathic troll objection! Overall, bitch! Language chips. You never said we couldn't use professional help. Uh, it says in the senior project handbook that you cannot use professional help. I'm sorry, Miss Bell, I don't make the rules. Wait, you wrote the rule book. Andy, do you want to go down two letter grades as well? Wait, what? We went down two letter grades? That's right, Mr. Hamster. And your bug project better be amazing. Class dismissed. Hey, hey! What's up, buddy? Not now, Andy. Listen, man, you're not gonna fail, bro. That's why you got me, man. Andy's in the house. I'm here to help you. And look, boom, to film you. Close up. Close up. Oh. <laughs> um, yeah, oh, that's right. You're film. Yeah, come on, man. Um, um, rolling sound. All right, set dressing. Or draw your hair's hairs look, I mean it, it looks good. Alright, here we go. Ready? And action! Uh hey, my name is Peter Hammer. Yes. Um, my senior project is on deceptive coloration for the sake of self-preservation. While they have brilliant coloring, nudie branches are famous for their disposable penises, which allow them to have sex more frequently. Wait, disposable penis? Alright, I gotta I gotta see this. <laughs> look at this. The penis, say it with me. Penis. I don't have the penis with Peter. Shut that camera off before I shove it down your throat. Whoa, <laughs> Natalia, relax. I, you're gonna pop a blood vessel. Did you see that picture? I looked awful. It really wasn't that bad. No, no, it was. It was humiliating. And you know what the worst part is? Dropping two letter grades? No, that I already booked the Performing Arts Center for the show, so it's happening regardless of her stupid rules. Why does she have to ruin my life just because she's bitter about hers? What are you talking about? Well, legend has it that Miss Getty had the nerve to ask out the hottest guy at Kennedy. But she weighed like 250 pounds. She was a total shimmy. I checked her yearbook picture. Oh, no offense, Andy. Oh, it's okay. I'm not a, I'm not a whale. I'm a humanist. Did you guys know that, that Miss Getty has these weird pictures of animals humping each other in her office? It's really weird. Oh, breaking news! Oh my god! She is into bestiality. I knew it. I knew it. I'm not surprised. Okay, Angie, I'm the camera. Surprised. Is that the flailing monkey? Happy baby pose, actually. Huh, close. So what can I help you with? Uh, I was thinking of uh, throwing like a get-together uh, party thing at my place. Really? Miss Square Peg wants to throw a party? My parents are out of town till Wednesday. <laughs> so what are you thinking? Tom Cruise, risky business <laughs> style? No, uh, I was thinking more of like a, a senior slash truce party. Senior slash truce party? Never heard of one. It could be a peace offering with Natalia. And I was thinking you and I could uh, co-host it together. I mean, okay. A little weird, but sure. What do I have to do? Can you score some booze? Oh yeah, easily. <laughs> My dad's got a stockpile in the kitchen. Really? Thought he was like a conservative politician or something. Oh, he is. It's not a date or anything weird like that. It's just two friends co-hosting a party together. You're <sighs> gay, right? Yes, absolutely. Okay, sorry about that. Continue. It's all good. All right. I'll see you at the party. Find your inner she or whatever. Thank you. Namaste. Bye, see you in a roll. Excuse me. Hi. <laughs> uh, can I help you? Hi, hello, yes, I was just in the neighborhood collecting signatures from all the residents. A uh, signature for what? 
Oh, well, we are, we're trying to recall the mayor. <laughs> really? Yes, yes, yes. Apparently, he has been groping ladies at the uh -huh. senior center. <laughs> and uh, we need, like, 20,000 signatures by the end of the week to get him run out of office. Is Mr. Peter Hammer available? No, I'm sorry, he's not. Plus, oh. he's not of age to vote or sign anything. So maybe just his father, then. Sorry, we're not together anymore. Plus, we're not even the homeowners of this property. You're not? No, my son and I just live here. I'm the housekeeper. Oh, okay. I have to go get more signatures. So I will thank you and uh, go women's rights. Strange. Sam, come on, talk to me. I know it's not right. I know it's, I know it's not perfect. I wanted to say that you look really handsome tonight. Well, here's to us. Miss mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Getty! Miss Getty! I have news. Oh. What, what is this? What are you, what, who are you? Oh, oh. <laughs> three, two, one. Peter Hammer is not who he says he is. He's not a millionaire, but a housekeeper's son. <gasps> oh, that is delicious. What else do you know? There's gonna be a party tonight with alcohol. <gasps> I have the same fridge. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Fridge. <laughs> that is so funny. See, this is why we get along so well. We like the same things. Um, I'm gonna get dressed for the party. Okay. First official party together. Hello. I'm Andy. Uh, today is uh, May 2nd. Location at Samantha's house on Breckenridge Lane. And uh, as you know, graduation is right around the corner, so everyone's all crazy. But um, luckily, we find ourselves today at an underground raging party. <laughs> so, you know, some couples are hoping to get lucky, but let's just be real. Half of them are going to leave with a heartbreak, in tears. Well, if they're not going to leave at all, they're going to wake up here and not know what. Yo, you good, bro? I'm not going to graduate. It's your third time not graduating. It's your failing ass. All right. All right, sorry about that. Okay, mm. here we go. Follow me. I will show you how we do it over here. Let's go. Hello, ladies. Can I please get a kiss for Andy? Oh, you love kissing Andy. Andy will kiss you back. Hey, let's play house. You guys be the door, and I'll slam you. Eh? Upstairs? All right. You know, you could just pretend that I'm Peter. What? <laughs> Why would I have to do that? I'm so comfortable right now. Are you not comfortable? Are you uncomfortable? Because I'm comfortable. I'm <laughs> Still, real. it's fine. I'm comfortable. I'm wearing flip-flops. It's all good. <laughs> right. So what are you doing your fashion show? Uh, I booked the gym. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's a good venue. Yeah, it works. It's luxurious Oh, enough. and now for the main attraction. What are you talking about? Oh, you guys came together. Yeah, I couldn't turn down an invite from Spencer and you. I figured you'd be too embarrassed to show your faces. <laughs> you know, well, you figured wrong. <laughs> Apparently. Yeah. Why are you not wearing real shoes? What happened to the pair that I bought you? I donated them to Africa. You remember that, right, Natalia? <sighs> Africa, God. I really need punch. Anyone? Yeah, Anyone? me too. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. uh, so you're here actually dating her. I am actually dating her, and you're actually dating him. Actually, I am. That's awesome, because the last time I checked, he's actually into guys. He plays for both teams, actually. Fantastic. <laughs> Amazing. Great. Amazing. Watch out, bro. Oh, man. Oh, man. Isn't it the same dude that shit himself last year? It's Keela, your favorite. You remembered. Of course, Natalia. So you're throwing a party with her. Yes, I am. Make you jealous? Of what? I thought you turned gay. <laughs> you can't turn gay. 
Spencer Grace, you better be gay. Why else did we break up? We broke up because you're a shitty girlfriend. I mean, let's be honest, and tell you all you care about are handbags and Jimmy Choo's. And you know I don't care about shoes. And don't even get me started on when I try to talk about my dad because you just ignore me like I never even said anything. Okay, well at least you talk to your dad. My dad didn't remember my birthday like he doesn't every year. And you know that and you didn't bother to text or call or anything. You are so self-centered. You were a shitty boyfriend too with your self-righteous new age mumbo jumbo. But now I have a new boyfriend and he is a hot nerd. That's, that's great for you. I guess that makes us even. Hello, face. <laughs> You're editing that out, right, clown? Man, you ain't editing nothing. Fantastic. Excellent. Stupendous sure. room. Oh. So, I was thinking that maybe we should get away tomorrow, go to the beach or something. Oh, uh, yeah, the, 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 <laughs> that'd be great, except I was hoping we'd work on the senior project tomorrow. Mm, mm, that's great, but yeah, uh, sure. Spencer, I'm so sorry about this. It's not personal. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, what the, what the hell was that, that Sam? That was me getting really turned on by the music. That was horrible. Why did you just do that? No, it wasn't. I, I did it because I like you so much. That was like kissing my cousin. And now Natalia is mad at me because of you. Okay, that's great. Because it all matters about Natalia, right? Why do you even care? You broke up with her. Because. Because why? Because you're not actually broken up? Because you have because a. Because I'm not gay. <laughs> oh my god, shit is getting real. Spencer just got bitch slapped. And I, I knew it was gonna happen, but. It's getting real, man. Follow me. Let's see what else happens. Teenage drinking? Uh, Miss Getty, I, I, I can explain. Where are your parents? Out of town on business. Tell them to call me immediately. The office just got a request from you to use the gym for your fashion presentation. Well, guess what? I'm denying it. What? You're lucky that I don't call the cops right now. <laughs> you just went down two letter grades, miss. My bad. What is this, Sam? Are you performing communion? Exorcism is more like it. This is, don't, I can't even. Think of some shit on your shoes. There is shit on oh, my shoes, I, Andy. I, I, oh. Oh. Right. oh. Of course she does. She's a pathetic troll who hates everybody. This one time, I saw her spill her frappuccino all over my college portfolio sketches. <laughs> she didn't even say sorry. She didn't do anything to be sure that I don't go to fashion school. You gotta strike that from the record, Andy. Oh. You gotta strike that from the record, Andy. I know. Oh, come on. <sighs> He's in my video production class. He left his hard drive there. I swear to God, she hasn't been laid since at least the 94 Guns N' Roses do. <laughs> well, that's just not true. She's a pathetic troll who hates everybody. I hate some people. 
this just in, Getty is into the bestiality, and I am not surprised. We're all supposed to be meeting at Peter's house next. God, is that your car? Uh, yeah, I mean, not yet. My dad said he'd give it to me when I graduate. Get the keys. <laughs> Whoa, uh, yeah. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the Batmobile. <laughs> and I'm your bad Batgirl. Wow, Andy, you know a code. Good for you, let's go. We're best friends. Yo, I'm telling you right now, man, this ice cream, bro, best flavor I've ever had, ever, ever, ever. You don't think you're exaggerating just a little bit? Just a little bit? No, no, I'm not exaggerating a little bit. Yo, if you keep eating that much ice cream, you're gonna have cardiac arrest before we even finish our project. All right, who has cardiac arrest nowadays? All right, listen, okay, like, in life, Certain people need, you know, certain things to get them through certain things. It's like all those different yoga poses, it gets you through the day. See, me? Me, on the other hand, mmm, what you know about these 32 flavors? Mmm. One, you about to try this one right now. Right? Mm. Look at that, look at that. Let it simmer, let it soak, let it just melt. Just, just savor it. Put it back in there, just, there you go. You gotta, mmm. No, I'm not, I don't want it, uh-uh. It already hit you, hit you, mmm, that's all you. Romantic. I, I, I need to get back home to my bugs. I, I think I accidentally left them out in the sun and I don't want them to be shriveled up raisin nests by the time I get back. <laughs> You're so tense. Just relax, okay? <laughs> Just, uh, I, I am relaxed. Sorry about that. Oh, you love it. I see. Oh shit, we need to get back. What? Where the heck is he? Her. <laughs> Where else? You know, he's the one who's always freaking out about this project. And now he can't keep his brat worse than his pants. Yo, man, your neck is red, bro. Yeah? Yes. You think it's the tofu masala? Definitely. So what's like your deepest fear? I don't think that's an appropriate question. Mine's manatees. <laughs> oh no. Way back. Thank you for gracing us with your presence, your majesty. What are you guys doing here? The senior project, dude. What is wrong with your face? Is it still messed up? What is going on? What's wrong with you, man? Why are you crawling? crawling? Hey, guys, please pack up right now. I'll explain later, just pack up, please. Did you drop a tab? What are you doing here? Oh, I could ask you the same question. Guys, you have to get out now. Are you serious? Yeah, yes, I'm serious. I'll explain everything. Oh, okay, you want a quickie with your new girlfriend? Fine, I get it. Go right ahead. No, 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 not that way. This way. Are you kidding me? No, really? I'm, right now? Are you serious? I'm serious. Let's go. Oh, come on. on. This is come on. Man. Go down the hall. Down the hall. That must be Schneidelberg. Jack up. Let's roll. Come on. Go, 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 go
Eva, my luggage is in the car. Where are we? Right here, right here. Please oh, go. Oh. Just go. Oh, oh, Natalia, go. <laughs> I am not doing that. Spencer, come on, let's go. And you're up. You're up. Oh, help me, help me. Hello, uh, can I help you? You must be Peter's mom. She is. Eddie! Oh my God! Oh, Eddie! Oh, 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 excuse me. Oh, oh. oh my God, Peter? Uh, it just, it's not what it looks like. Oh God! I think I broke my spleen. What is going on here? Uh, I, I can explain. What would you like to explain about how you all talk about me behind my back like venomous tarantulas? Jill showed me the footage. Hey, that was my hard drive. What would you rather explain to all your friends here about your living arrangement on this property? About how you've been lying about who you are this entire time? Peter, what is she talking about? Tell them. Hey, don't tell them shit, bro. <laughs> My mom's a live-in housekeeper here. You get to live in the maid's quarters. This house belongs to Victor von Schneidelberg. Who the hell is Victor von whatever? I am Victor von Schneidelberg. Why is my Lamborghini out in the driveway? Who, who are all these people? So this isn't your house? I swear I was going to tell you. Spencer? Is he on drugs? Spencer! Yo, call 911, he can't breathe. Spencer. Let's get him to the hospital. Professor Grace's father? Yes, what happened? I'm Dr. Kaplan. Your son had an attack, a severe case of allergic angioedema. What does that mean? He's allergic to shellfish. Oh, my God. I gave him Lynch's lobster ice cream. That's OK, Andy. You didn't know. We will have to keep him overnight in the hospital to monitor his vitals. And he should be able to go in the morning. Can I see him? Yes, sure. Right this way. The adult onset is usually the first time we have the uh, Are we going to have to move again, Mom? I don't know. I don't know what he's going to say. Meet you back in the car. So where were you two? We were headed to the beach. In your fake car. God, you make me sick. I need to get some air. Natalia. I told you things about me nobody else knows. And you lied to me. We thought we could trust you. Unfreaking believable. If you're just gonna throw me out like that, like, at least just pick a window I can fit through, all right? I'm sorry, Eddie, I wasn't thinking, I, I panicked. It's all good, bro. It's, uh, it's crazy what, what, what food can do to your body, right? It's just, and I gotta cut it out with all the, Chips and ice cream and all this junk food, man. Maybe you can try Spencer's Octo stuff when he gets better. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure I will. <laughs> yeah, definitely try that. <laughs> hey, how funny would it be if, if he was in there right now on the bed, just in, in the Shavusavakava pose? <laughs> Shavasana. What do you think the doctors would tell me? <laughs> Shavasana. Shavasana. Just say it right. I said that. I said Shavasana. Your lie almost lost us this opportunity, but he said we can stay. I didn't want to lie. Then why did you? The senior project is killing me. 
Jim, he'll find a way to make up those missing points. That scholarship is not running away. We work too hard for that. Mom. You know, all this time, I never made an effort to get to know anybody or make new friends. I messed it up. They hate me. They probably won't graduate because of me. I know it's hard to see the light at the end of the tunnel, but it's there if you keep looking. Just don't make an anthill out of a molehill. Wait, don't you mean don't turn a molehill into a mountain? You know what I mean. Put these away. Look who it is, Mr. Von Schneidelberg III. I'm really sorry we said those things. I know you don't have it in your heart to fail us. You don't know me at all. I do. You were just like us at one point in your life. You wanted to belong. You said what you came to say. Actually, I uh, have something else. <sighs> Look, I, I know you both hate me. Just hear me out. Look, there's a way we can still pass a senior project. We don't have enough time. It's due tomorrow. I worked out a deal with her. What are you suggesting? That you combine fashion shows. <laughs> oh, no. Absolutely not. Look, I know you guys hate each other, but you've both said things that the other should hear. Like what? Well, like my first day here. Sam said that Natalia looked perfect and pretty all the time. You think I'm pretty? Maybe I said a version of that. And when we were in Sen, you said that Sam was incredibly talented. Okay, what happens in Sen stays in Sen. Either you guys work together or you spend another year in Kennedy. I think you got the necklace happening and we're fine. Don't overpower. We you have to finish this. This is, this is the top Listen, priority. man, you're not gonna fail, I bro. I can't stop thinking about Spencer. After you graduate, y'all, y'all, y'all will see it. He didn't even know. Don't beat yourself up about that. Thank you. He had literally his dad didn't know. I need to apologize, man. It's really nice of you, Peter, for making Spencer's new recipe. Well, no, brother, man. Give this a try. How does it taste? That's pretty good. I only have to make a hundred more of these. It is so much easier to accessorize Prada over this eco stuff. You're gonna have to stop complaining. The show's tomorrow. Tomorrow, wow! Is tomorrow, that is why I said the words tomorrow. You're oh, making okay. me laugh, that's weird. Have you gone to see him yet? No, not yet. Please do not try this. If you have any food allergies whatsoever, thank you. Mr. Chris, I thought Spencer was in the hospital. So he sent me here to check up on his senior project. Oh, please, by all means, try his recipe. It's Thank you. This looks delicious. Uh, Andy, you ready? What? Oh, I was born ready. What are you talking Please about? Please enjoy the food. I have to go check up on some things. Enjoy. Thank you. Uh, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I would uh, like to welcome you to the newest um, brainchild of Samantha Willow and Natalia Bell. <laughs> are you okay? I'm gonna... Go to the bathroom. Uh, as you know, uh, our eyes can sometimes play tricks on us, but if you're smart, you will always see the true colors. It's going to be okay. So, friends? Go get ready. And today, we are here to celebrate the differences between us all. <laughs> okay. Um, but ladies and gentlemen, I give you deception. Here comes Peter. Look at him. The hottest hot nerd to ever grace hot nerd him. We're all nerdy tadpoles about to have an incredible makeover. Uh-oh, hot nerds. Woo! Hot nerds get all the hot girls. You feel me? 
so confused we made ourselves fake. Natalia! Show him how to do it, baby. Now sometimes we didn't get along. Take that, nerd. <laughs> but sometimes we party hard. Whew. Show him how to do it, baby. That's right. Yes, this is my favorite job. Everything you see was designed by Sam and Natalia, FYI. Now as we leave the high school nest, we realize an innocent kid can be dangerous. Yes, work it. There's just so many great looking people on stage. Woo! She'll show you how to do it. Look at that, a dress inspired by reptile. We have transformed like all animals in nature. Camouflage was our best weapon. But now, we have turned a new Look at it, sizzling like a snake. We have shed our past, and we will try our luck for a better tomorrow. Oh, look at the ladybug. Peter, you're the man. Everyone give it up for Peter. If you're not clapping, get out. Embrace life's thorny side. Especially if you trip up. And now, give it up for our beautiful Miss Getty! <laughs> She's killing it. Work it, Getty, work it! Yes. Oh, man. Be who you are. There's no need to deceive. Be the magnificent, beautiful... No. Get your ass out of here! I guess you could call this a huge success and a pass on all your projects. Congratulations. You're graduating. We did it. <laughs> we did it so oh, nice. it's like oh. the best party. All my best friends are on stage. I want to get on stage with you guys. Whoa, that's really weird. <laughs> that's like the first whole sentence that you've like ever said to me in life. How awkward is that? Well, I, I used to hang out with Natalia and them, so you know now they just call me a psychopath. <laughs> that's crazy, cause my friends call me a creeper. You know, but I didn't like I didn't like the fact that you you know stole my hard drive and then you gave it to Miss Getty. No, I know. Look, I'm really. Do you maybe um do you maybe want to go go to a movie with me? We can go to a movie. Really? Yeah. Do you want to see like a slasher movie where they cut people's throats? Yeah. Let's go. <laughs> okay. Oh, that's why I call you a psychopath. No. <laughs> no, psychopath. <laughs> oh. I'll bring my knife collection. Oh shit. <laughs> I got you something. Did. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. It's for one year better. Ta da! Wow. <laughs> These are actually amazing. I know that you don't usually like material things, but I thought you might like these. Hey. I'm so sorry about how everything happened. And um, tomorrow at school, I promise, I'm gonna tell everyone that I was faking it. You know, I patched things up with my dad as well. <laughs> He's gonna let me go to India for a whole year. India? You could always come. Only if you promise to wear shoes. Done and done. <laughs> Now that we've all officially are about to graduate, I think I might actually miss you a little bit. Who knows? Maybe we'll end up together. Yeah, I don't see that happening because I don't date hot nerds. <laughs> I mean, if only you had some sort of creepy bug collection, then I'd be into it. 
I guess this is it. Off to the real world. I know, it's depressing, isn't it? I mean, come on. Still got the summer together, right? <laughs> yo, 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 check this out. I just finished editing the video. Y'all ready to see you? Oh, yeah. All ready? Are you ready? Hi. Check this out. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. I know. It's like, we did that. We did that. Turn on your face. Turn on your face. I wish I was this Marker. way. Always. You are so self-centered. You are a shitty boyfriend too, okay? When Everyone. You know, mine is death, but it's death by gummy bears. Because I always thought if you were going to kill someone, you would replace like those chewable gummy bear vitamins with actual gummy bears. I literally picked up dog shit from two neighborhoods over. Dog shit colors I ain't never even seen. Green dog shit, brown dog shit, tan dog shit, red dog shit. I don't even know where that's at. But it's covered in me right now. You know how that is? They'll never find me. I'm a ghost. I'm a shitty ghost. <laughs> Come party, come party with me, girl. Bring a friend, better yet, make it three, girl. Maybe this your world and you got it, girl. This should be a crazy night, so baby, dance for me. Tell me, do you wanna dance? Baby, dance for me. Tell me.